Hey, my name's Sarah. I'm a homeschooling mom of four in Tennessee, and life on our farm is never dull. show you guys what I got at Yoder's today so um, I got two containers of their whip topping um, you just basically add in some milk or um, well I thought it was water anyway yeah you add in some milk and you whip it up and it's whip topping so that's pretty awesome I got some um, fajita seasoning and then I got a couple of these um, mini M&Ms uh, for cookies, like baking and stuff, little bars. Um, I got these dill pickle peanuts because that just sounds amazing. <laughs> and some crackers, vegetable crackers. I got some farmer's cheese. Yum! And I got some instant clear gel for pies. It was on clearance. Strawberry poppy seed salad dressing. I saw a salad made with this and it looked amazing. So I'm going to try that out. I also saw this on a YouTube video or Instagram or something recently. Um, Weaver's Dutch Country Seasonings. It's the farm dust seasoning and apparently it's supposed to be good like on everything. <laughs> I got some honey mustard powder. And then some um, Better Than Bouillon. This one's a vegetable base. I also picked up this green tea peppermint. I really love green tea and I love peppermint tea mixed and so I thought well that would be pretty good. It's all in one, one tea bag. My peppermint green tea. And then I got this kind, energy tea. It's with green tea and yerba mate. I thought hmm, we all need a little energy in our lives. <laughs> uh, let's see, what else? I got a um, big bag of the yellow cornmeal. It's the coarse one. I like to put it down on the bottom of the pizza pans when we make pizza. This is the golden toasted shredded coconut. I thought it might be really yummy in granola. So, and it's good on top of desserts as well. Um, I got some mini oyster soup crackers. I love these little ones in um, like a snack kind of cracker. You season them and they're really good. So I got a couple bags of those. 
and I got some of the radiator noodles and these are the imitation bacon bits imitation bacon bits um, for different things the kids like those I thought this was neat because it's coconut oil, but it's the butter flavored one for popcorn. And I thought I could just put it in the bottom of the whirly pop to pop the popcorn in, and it would give it that little buttery flavor. Got little tiny, little itty bitty micro marshmallows. And then um, the kids are wanting a bonfire, so I grabbed some marshmallows for them. I also got um, some root beer. And like I said, we stopped at a little farm stand and got some strawberries and tomatoes. And then the last stuff that I got is, um, I don't know if the, this is Norpro. It's just a little mini colander because um, I'm always needing to like rinse things like small amounts of, say, cashews for our cashew cheese sauce. And so I need a little colander for that. So I got that. And then this here for like gravy and stuff. This is all Rata, or Rata, however you want to say it. And I needed a few different knives, so this one here, um, yeah, it's the little granny pearer knife. And then I had one of these and lost it somewhere, but it's based, it's the, basically a spreader um, for like frosting and stuff. And then this, I believe, was a tomato slicer, yes. Tomato slicer knife. And then I've been wanting one of these for quite a while. It's a tomato chopper. I mean, I guess it could be chopper for anything. But, um, yeah. So, got one of those. And then I got a broom. This one is Soft Sweep. And, um... Yeah, just needed a new broom and saw this, so grab that. So that is my Yoder's haul.